<sighs> I'm not enjoying this as much as I thought I would. Maybe it's your old bones, you know? Every time Zaroff punches you, there's this ugly cracking sound. And for some reason, it just keeps ringing and ringing in my ears. <sighs> I hope I never get old. <sighs> it took me some time to realize what Celine was doing in Jagholm. Why she took so many risks going through the pass of Ophara. was trying to get to you. And why? Not to drop by and say hello, of course. We both know that Celine, for all her grand gestures and heartfelt tirades, has the cold heart of a calculating witch. She went to you because you had something she needed. You know something about a cure to the corrosion, don't you? As I've said, this little rough and tumble isn't bringing me as much joy as I thought it would. So, I've done a bit of soul searching and asked myself what's missing. Do you know what that is, Alfarius? Selene. In your place. So you see, there's only one thing left for you to decide before you die. Would you like me to get my answer through Celine or through you? Either way, you'll die. <laughs> Make no mistake. You know I'm not lying. I'm a paragon of truth. So... My old friend, which will it be? Boss, somebody's coming. Oh, then by the gods, chop him up or throw him off the cliff. Can't you see I'm having a moment here? It's the priestess from Jagholm. The one you called the Mad One. Celine. On a silver platter! As if the gods heard my wish! <laughs> Let him go, Vaughn. Why, for your head on a pike, my dear, I will! Hey! Or I guess I could settle for something a little less ghoulish. Like... Where can I find a cure for the corrosion? Celine, don't say another word! I'll make the choice easy for you. Either you talk, or our friend Alfarius here loses his head. Zeroff, on my signal, chop, chop, choppity chop. Vaughn, you will regret this. One. Don't say anything! Celine! Two. Okay, we're at two and still no answer. Oh, I must say I'm disappointed. He's your master, Celine. Like a father figure. And? It's... I'm the man you want. I'm a survivor of the corrosion. No! Huh? What? You? The vagrant? You can't be serious. You? That's the big secret? The secret cure for the corrosion? <laughs> hey. <laughs> oh, no, that's ridiculous. <sighs> I suppose I'll have to get the answer the hard way. Zaroff, I changed my mind. Kill them all, except for the Mad One. 
Make sure she watches while you kill her bodyguards. Let her writhe in the guilt. With pleasure. So, Celine, want me to put a cap in his head? Creeps come at a discount. No need, Fallon. He's a monster. He'll try to have you expelled and executed, Celine. We can't allow it. No. He won't talk about what happened here. Because it means people finding out I defeated him. Again. Right, Vaughn? <coughs> Wretched peasant girl! Leave me alone with him. This isn't working. Seven years of jealousy and hatred. For a knee in the dust. What happened that day it was not natural. You cheated! And now you volunteer to find a cure to the corrosion just to compete with me? In the hope of some sort of rematch? Don't flatter yourself. I only volunteered because I know that only I can save the world. The world. But does the world need the Sanctorium in its current state, Vaughn? Haven't you seen the faces of the people in Jagholm? The fear in their eyes? We could do better. Don't you think? We are the gods chosen! The Sanctorium! Without us, Herion is doomed to fall into the hands of the Archelites! Why do you care about what these people, these peasants think? They're supposed to serve us! No, Vaughn. It's the other way around. We are supposed to serve them. Help them reach the gods, not use them like a human ladder. Just the same way we're supposed to revere the crystals, not pillage them. I don't understand. You're a fool, but you're not stupid. You must have felt it too. The magic is disappearing. If we don't do something, we'll lose everything. I don't understand a word of what you're saying, mad one! You don't have to hate me. I'm not your enemy. I will kill you. I will kill you! I will kill you! I'll kill you! Once again, you arrive late. Don't push yourself, Alfarius. Those guys really did a number on you. The Cathedral isn't far from here. You must. Not now, Master. Let's find a place where you can rest first. And everyone? I think we need to talk. It's time you know what's really happening. Let's find a place for Alfarius to rest first. <laughs> 